Don't act like you want check. to fit. Yo, check, big hacks, big hacks, big motherfucking hacks. Big Nick, big, 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 big Nick. Nick, so big. My name is Meathead. Meathead. Need something, mm. man. I'm so straight off bored. the rock. All I do is sit around so fucking playing chess, <laughs> losing, laying around. My my dope my dopamine spike mm -hmm. last week was laying in my yard with my dog brushing his hair in the sun. That's that's pretty, and he was dude, so I, I would he was, love to do that. He was actually so happy. Dude, but I was just sitting there and I just started like smiling and I was like, wow, that's that was the only one this week. <laughs> that's the only smile. That was that, that was probably <laughs> the smile this week. That was the only smile this week. Like I don't you, know. You, man, you, I just, you, you don't I mean obviously like this is a dumb question, but obviously you, you smile when Michelle walks in the room. No, we both <laughs> just frown. <laughs> we're both like she she woke up this morning wasn't talking to me i was like oh here we, I, here, I, we I, go. here we go i think, I, I what, think I'll be like, what's wrong what happened but like it's it's the fucking dogs like she was she was up at like 2 a.m 3 a.m 5 a.m yeah that's why i tell this, this is why i tell people because i just don't 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 have don't have edit that you handle that oh i say that too yeah her. yeah yeah there's nothing wrong. Yeah, no, no. I, I, June and That's I had a very, it. very clear agreement, okay, from the beginning, which was, I don't want any more dogs beyond these three. Same. Okay. And mine was the one. We got four <laughs> Milo, more. who passed away, R.I.P. R.I.P. Um, four additional dogs were acquired since then, and my only <laughs> request. Four additional. <laughs> my only request was, I... I'm expecting you to handle all that shit, all that piss. Yeah. Okay. Now, <laughs> yeah. how you handle that? Whether you hire services, dog sitters, dog groomers. Can I complain about some? Is Go this the place? It, is this? That's, this, this is, was, that's literally that's what this is That's why this for. was made. Okay. So here's the deal. We have a dog room. You guys have seen it? Uh, no. I, I can't remember specifically what it is. Okay. I've it's, only been to your house like twice. Is that crazy? That is, is you don't I mean, like I've never, people. I've never been to your house or your apartment. You don't like Is that crazy? I mean, if I had your house, uh, I'd be, yeah. guys, come on. Or I'd That's probably be. No, because I know if what's going to happen. I know. I've seen what happens. <laughs> and, I, and I will get offended. I know what happens. When, when people invite you two to Seth's house and you guys don't show up, I notice. Really? Yeah. Because I'm like, and I'm like, if I invite them to my house and they don't show up, fuck them. What? But not like I don't I, know not, if I've ever like been invited to Seth's house. I wasn't last night for the NBA Finals game too. Uh, no, but you were the week before that. To be fair, I wasn't going to go. I was okay. Go exactly. Back. People, people. No, I was. Was that? That's how I just assume I'm. Uh, whatever. No, I don't think I was invited last if you're, week. If either. you're going to invite me at night on a weekday, I can't go. You got work. Yeah, it's the only time. The, I hear only Sunday count as weekday. Hear, but what the fuck were you doing besides? Paying? When last night? Yeah, I just didn't want to. Go there, drink, dude, Seth, wake, Seth wake lives, up, and underperform. Dude, Seth lives forty-five it, minutes from me one now. One second from where I live, and I didn't want to go last night. <laughs> and the only reason I went is because Matt was visiting, and I didn't want him to think that I wasn't excited about him moving here. Mm. Uh, so I went. Both texted. He's like, he's like, yo, Seth's, and I was like, fuck, he's already there. And I was like, yeah, I'm on my way. And then, I, and then when I texted the thread, I'm on my way. He then texted, all right, I'm going to get dressed and start heading up. And I'm like, oh, you and haven't he, even he fucking down, left? He and he lives, lives down, down here, here and shit. <laughs> so he was 45 minutes away. Yeah. So anyway, uh, I'm glad that I went because Denisa, uh, uh, Ice's um, girlfriend, she made this fucking charcuterie board from heaven. She loves doing that. Dude, she is an artist. And... And Peterman did this like flower of salamis and shit. It was pretty good. Oh, I fucking destroyed the yeah. shit out of that. Anyway, my complaint is this. <laughs> she loves dogs and I love my dogs, but she loves dogs. She loves fucking crows and shit. And uh, crows? Crows? You know, yeah, crows are fucking mega smart. She's like an animal, just pure Raven, animal lover. Her, her middle name is PETA. I don't know what that means. I'm kidding. It's not. 
the pet oh the, the pet thing the, the, i thought you were talking uh, about the bread no oh no no, no. Bread. no guadalupe is her name guadalupita pita and the, oh, no, oh, I'll see. uh shout out to pita and her uh soon-to-be husband mr castro on their team Shouts out to his wrestling match his fucking insane wrestling match but what? anyways i got a dog room his wrestling match in this fucking dog room <laughs> and we have this thing called you didn't see his wrestling match on twitter dude no. it was fucking in front of like 70 or no, i don't, don't know don't say anything all right I, I posted that story after this podcast. Nobody tells him any. Go watch that and have the same experience that I had. I'm not even going to say anything about it. I'm not going to say. Oh, oh, yes, I did see that. He said he lived out his childhood dream and shit. Yeah, yeah. but did you see the moves? I didn't see the moves. Okay. Right I only saw Go like a, see a little highlight. Castro's fucking moves. He was doing his thing. Dude. I literally said, what the <laughs> fuck was that? <laughs> I My mind could not believe it. We have a dog room. <laughs> we have grooming day two mm. two groomers come to the crib how often is this once a month two groomers come to the crib they cut all seven of our dog's hairs but in total by the end of the day fifth 17 dogs leave my house because jude who loves dogs our neighbors from across the street oh my god their dogs from mm. the other side. The, our neighbors across the street are the fucking coolest neighbors I've ever had. I, I consider them friends even. And Damn. you know I don't got friends. That's crazy. Uh, yeah. And then the people to Seth and, Seth and Iz's dogs come over. Oh, Matt and Haley are moving. They have two fucking dogs. Guess where oh, they're going to get their shit my. cut. Mm. And then these guys, these groomers take a shit in my toilet on my wing of the house. They got to be there for like 12 hours. Yeah. And they heat up their food in my theater room. This one time I was watching. I was, I was, so they bring packed right. lunch. Yeah. Like no, a, they're there. Listen, I'm complaining about it. I, I'm, I'm just doing it for the levity of it. But it does bother me a little bit. They heat up their food in my they theater room. Their food in my theater in room. In the kitchen in my theater room. I okay, mean, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> but, but that's your, y'all's agreement. Next to the next to the popcorn and what do you call those? Uh, the cotton, the cotton candy. Next to the cotton candy. Wait, do these guys not know what peanut butter and jelly is? God. See, I'm in the same boat, almost kinda. I don't um, think you're in the same boat. I so we had one dog, and then she really wanted Chewy, and I I didn't want one. I really don't didn't even want a dog, but she had a dog already, Milo. And I turned, or eventually loved him, and um, whatever. But then we got Chewy, and I didn't really want, and I was like, we could, like, our, our friend found him, her friend found Chewy in her apartment dumpster. Like, wrapped, like, in a bag or some shit. And he heard the cries. Uh, yeah. It's, <sighs> which is insane. Always sucks. So, she, like, she's... I would, I, I, I hope shit like that never happens in front of me i hope that i never see somebody mistreating their dog in front of me because it's like not not only like this dude is ruining two people's like lives right the dog's life and eventually my life because i can't stand by and let something happen i wish my brain could i cannot get out of my own way when it comes to letting people know when they're being stupid when they're being unreasonable and when they're being mean I can't, I can't. And he my, was being mean. Dude, if I saw somebody kick a dog, dude, oh. I would, I don't know what I would do. Yeah. No, I, I don't know either. And I'm, and I'm, I, I know what I want to do, but I'm also afraid of like the consequences these days. Cause it seems like. It seems like someone does. Around, someone. Can't go around murdering anymore. Goddamn you it. can't even just like beat him up or you like go to jail and then you have a felony or just like you. <laughs> Dude, it's, you have neck tattoos. That's the same thing I'm, as a I'll, felony. I'll be jailed for like six months off like a fight or something. Um, I would not let that happen. I have good lawyers. Where was I? So we found Chewie in a dumpster. Or her friend did. So we go there. We visit it. Michelle's like, come on, come on. And I, and I was so bored. I was like, fine, we'll just go visit it. <laughs> just no dope. I was like, puppy dope. You know, might have a good night. <laughs> We visited. It It was super <laughs> playful, super nice. It was super. Chewy was super cute, and so uh, and she was like, "Please." She was like, "We don't have to, but like, I mean, we could try it." I was like, "All right, let's. We can. Tr let's try it out." And in my head, <laughs> no, I already knew. Was so I was like, "Sure, let's try it out." But in my head, I was like, "I kind of want to as well," but like, I really don't. Like, I I don't want the dog. 
but I kind of. Yeah. Just looking at him, you're like, but I kind of. Yeah. Um, so we get Chewie, bring him home. Within one day, she was like, we can't take him back. He'll be traumatized. <laughs> so we. So I was dying when you were even imitating her on the last podcast. Because uh, that's not what she sounds time. like, but it's really it's good. It's not what she sounds like at all. Yeah. But, he is, but he'll be traumatized. We can't. Um, so we end up keeping him and he was the worst puppy ever. Like the best, the sweetest pup, just the sweetest, nicest, loving dog. But just everything you hate in a puppy is what he was. Shitting on couch? Shitting on, shitting on couch, shitting on carpet, make shitting on the walls. I, Mm. I made food one time. It was like 11 PM. I made food. I'm like bringing it upstairs because we had like a little loft area. Mm-hmm. I'm bringing it upstairs. And then I just see Chewie like run past me, start running down the steps. I'm like, what are you doing? And I like put my food down and I look down the steps and he's just, <laughs> his ass, he's like, his front is down, his back is yeah. up, his ass into is going into the wall. And just we do that. projectile shitting onto the wall while looking up the stairs at me. Well, he's and looking like, at you I, to make I, sure I, that, that, I, you're, that you got his back. I went into the bathroom, shut the door, and ate my food. Because, like, you could smell it. Oh. Like, the smell was everywhere. Like, was, I'd rather smell my shit, he said. But just piss shit. <laughs> I'd rather eat while smelling Wait, my shit. Wait, let me ask you something. Crying Did non-stop. you pull your pants down and sit on the toilet to eat? Or did you not even do I that? just stood in the toilet, staring in the mirror, thinking. I hate this. Is this is it? Yeah, <laughs> this is, this what, is I what I have now. I know there's still the walls the downstairs. But, like, I, I, I just couldn't sit. Like, I was so hungry. Fucking... But Chewie was just the the best, but everything he did everything wrong. Just it was the amount it, it, three pisses or like six pisses, five shits a day. Like, yeah. But it was it was just insane, dude. And then our newest dog, yeah, she guys, randomly you guys just Milo passed. One. She was she's been she was sad. She was like, let's get a new puppy. She was looking at the Dallas Animal Shelter or whatever for like weeks. She was like, I'm going to go get a dog today. I was like, no, you're not. She was like, yes, I am. I was like, if you come back here with a dog, I'll like actually be mad. But do you say like, I- I'm going to leave? I don't say that. Uh, why? <laughs> but. I told no. Jude, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, gorgeous. I, there's no more dogs in our future. If you choose to get a, you're going to have to make a choice at one point, whether it's husband or dogs. And I fucking mean that. Right. And she's just like, I, I don't think. I listen, and, and listen, and, and I cannot <laughs> take heartbreaks like that. It literally hurts my soul. What, like when dog these, heartbreaks? When these fucks pass away. Yeah. You know? Like, it, 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 it like, right, like last week, for example, it was, it was a very bad day. We, uh, we get told that Henry's third heartbeat is, is not doing so well, right? So it's like every third heartbeat, like there's a weakness in the third chamber or some shit. Shout out Wu-Tang, 36 chambers, death kit. Um, anyway. That, that doesn't relate. Doesn't relate. <laughs> that was my Tourette <laughs> slash ADHD slash autism slash fucking. Make light of a fucking situation you hate. Um, Wu-Tang. Wu-Tang. Uh, <laughs> woof. Okay, no, this is Rough Riders. Wu-Tang. So. Anyway, so she tells me, and then she tells me that they found something in, in, in Benji's nos- top of nostril that's, that's cancerous. And even talking about it, like, I feel myself becoming human, right? Like, emotions and shit. But I, like, <laughs> it's, Benji, it's the Benji right now, as we speak, is in chemotherapy right now. His first, his first chemo. Now, look, I have high hopes. Like, okay. I, it's like, they caught it early, so he's a golden doodle, he's fucking awesome, he's the leader of the pack, he's fucking smart. I call Matthew McConaughey, that's my güerito, my fucking blonde boy. Then we have Henry, same birthday as me, fucking, my fucking dog, he's got that. Luckily, they said that it was a mild case after they, they strapped him up to, like, all the shit. So, but I tell her, I'm like, I'm like, I don't know, she's like, well, like, would you rather feel the way you're feeling knowing that it was real, that you love these dogs so much and they were in our lives and this and the other? But at the same time, it's like, I, 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 there, are, there, are, there are three dogs right now that you don't own right now that match your personality and they would love you so much that when they died, it would feel like they tore your fucking heart out. But you don't have them. You don't even know they exist. So that heart 
It's not going to happen. So to mitigate that risk, just don't get any more fucking dogs. <laughs> yeah. I mean, even this one, I, I tell Michelle, I'm like, I don't even. Well, to finish the story, which I don't even remember what the Sorry. point of my story was going to be. It's my fault. But um, so she's sent, she's been looking at dogs on the Dallas Animal Shelter, whatever. And goes there. And I'm like, go look, whatever. <laughs> But like I, I was streaming and she was like, hey, I'm going to go. She like texted me and I just responded. No, but like I'm streaming. So I hear her leave the house. She comes back. I, I, I hear the door or whatever, or I see her pull in the driveway. So I check the phone, uh, my doorbell, my ring camera or whatever. And I just see a puppy in her hand and I'm like, oh, my God. And I was kind of pissed off here. I felt I kind of felt disrespected. <laughs> you should have. As the man of the house. No, no, not as that. Oh. As a partner, that she's supposed to love you the way that you love her. You, go on. Sorry. Well, same thing. Well, to me. Same thing. Like, I, like, if I, not that I'm sitting there trying to be like, no. And, like, I make the rules exactly. and you can't do shit. But it's like, I, I said no and you still went and did that. Exactly. But I, but I. <laughs> oh, yeah. But I know, like, but also in my head, I'm like, the, her. Her dog Milo, which was our our dog, mm -hmm. um, like she was obviously torn apart about him. It was what a few weeks to a month later, and I felt like maybe she just really needed something. I had an attitude for like two days about it, but then it was just like here it is again. Dogs up at night. She's taking, and I was like, y you wanted this dog, I did not. Like I'm not dealing. I'm not dealing. <laughs> I, I'm not dealing with the 3 a.m. I know you're taking dizzy. we we let them outside. It has to be like 16 times a day, like at 30 to 30 to an hour every single day because or else she just she still pisses. She still shits in the house, but it's just it's I said, no, you wanted this puppy. So now you sleep on the crib side because we have like a it's not like a actual baby crib but it's kind of like a baby crib connected into our bathroom so if she does piss hopefully she piss piss or shits in her bathroom tile or something, right? but they cry but she cries and then michelle has to go take them out and it's 2 a.m and it's 3 a.m and then 5 a.m and i'm just sitting there <laughs> yeah and i'm just sitting there trying to sleep i'm really not fucking sleeping i'm actually pissed <laughs> off to be sleep so that i don't have to help yeah, yeah. yeah. i hear like i hear her huffing and puffing <laughs> i know in her head she's sick of doing this by herself but in my head it's like Single i out didn't there. want the fucking dog bro if it was a bit if it was my child sure if it's with with chewy i helped a decent amount she did more <laughs> but i did help but with this one, I'm like, you gotta like handle that. I already, I'm taking what it out eight times it? a day. I don't, we don't fucking know. We just get some freak breed at the shelter <laughs> that no one else wants. No, no, it's a, uh, it's they. We think it's a husky mixed with something, and who, who knows? I don't really know breeds like that, but we, it, we think it's a husky mixed with something. But it's just like I just she's taking care of all of it, and so like today when she, she eventually got up and like. I showered and then she was getting ready and it was just like there were just no words being spoke. I was like, "What's wrong?" <laughs> and I don't know. It's just the fucking stress of it is so. Is it worth it? I don't know. No, man, it's not. I'm gonna tell you what's not worth it. Because it comes with a fucking unbearable heartbreak in the end. So all of the but imagine all, the shit life they would have lived without you. I don't have the to because they don't life. exist. They, they're literally <laughs> millions of, of living entities suffering this very fucking moment. But you don't see them. I think I got the perfect dog for me. Like, I just went, adopted a dog who was just like, I'm just trying to chill now. And he's... I, I did my thing. Yeah, I, I raced. I did my thing. He got neutered late, so he still wants to mark things. So I just throw a little fucking belly Viper. band on him. Yeah. Was your dog the maniac of racing? He has two chips. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah. So. Dude, it sucks that they... And now they, he just listen, chills. I, I, I just I, chill. did, did you mention that... Uh, I don't know if we can talk about this, but like they, the people that you adopted it from say you cannot race him 
or you cannot make them run or, or something yeah, like that? Like, is there yeah. like a, why is that a rule? Well, in Dallas, it's because they get, they, uh, they overheat so much because yeah, yeah. their skin is so thin. Yeah. So if you, if, if they get out and they really run after it in, in, uh, in summer in Dallas, they'll have a heat stroke. Yeah. Like immediately. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, there's like a lot, there's like a lot of stuff. <clears throat> Greyhounds are a weird breed. Do you ever just let him go ham? Like let him fucking uh, run? Every once in a while. Like, what do you, really what do, you do like for a, that though? What? Or what do you, like, do you just let him loose in like one of those soccer fields or have something? Have you ever taken, yeah, see, that's the thing. Like, did no. you, have you ever let him just fucking, dude? <sighs> and, uh, in Arizona, Because I, I feel like but... they, I mean, I don't know, but like they, just being that kind of dog, it's like they need to get that out every now and then. They I mean, kinda, I could be wrong. Yeah, they kind of do, but they're also, also like they're they're notorious like amazing apartment dogs because like they That's do. So, that makes no sense. Great Danes they, are apartment dogs. Yeah, so are Great Danes. Yeah. How, what? Ma- wh- why? <clears throat> they're, I don't know. My- they're they're low maintenance and they're very relaxed and they don't make they don't bark a lot. That so like they're not gonna mess with your neighbors and then also like you don't if you're on the third floor you don't have to continuously go down and Dude, uh, great and great to... Danes they're so big that they're not a fucking afraid of anything except going up stairs. Um, but Henry only barks when the little ones fucking fucks when they fucking bark. <laughs> is there? Do you have dogs that you only like? I don't no, know no, no. I, I every single one of my dogs is fucking. I love them. They all hold a special little place in your heart. Uh, of course, like I, I in that cold, dude, cold heart. In this cold, cold heart, man. Dude, dude all I just love dogs. Like all dogs. Dog breeds for apartments. See, this is why we <laughs> paid me at the big bucks. We have a Bichon Freeze. Greyhound, right there. Uh, we have a Bichon Freeze. Let me see. How about I don't. This? I don't know dog breeds. Okay, look. I have a Great Dane right there. Boom, left. It's a Great Dane Mastiff, and then I have a Bichon Freeze just named Coco. Uh, Grey Hot Shih Tzu, Basset Hound, Chihuahua. We have two Chihuahuas. Uh, we have one. It's not a Golden Retriever. But so does Jude do all the picking of like, I, I, does she like visit a pl- place? Does she go through like the private dog breeders? And like, like does she already knows what she wants? Or you don't really ask questions? I literally, you know? no, I don't. I don't ask questions. <laughs> but I literally just got a picture of a of this like cute little dog that she found, and I'm like, I'm oh like, no, I'm like, I'm like, baby, she found. She what found does one. found mean to you? She's part of like groups and shit. <laughs> she's part, <laughs> she's of, part of a Facebook group who found. <laughs> yeah. So she, and then she saw the pic, so now she yeah, found it. Now listen, it's her responsibility. You guys don't rescue it. It's what's gonna, it gonna what's no. Gonna what's what's what's, what's crazy is, is, is Dallas she, Animal Shelter, and then we'll get it. No, what she, no, we would never. We would never. We would never. She she would be she would she would be like like I support all your dreams and I was like yeah but my you benefit from all of my dreams <laughs> right drastically it, no it, uh, equally <laughs> as as it should uh and and then and I'm like but the dog like you only want to get the dog you and Liv only want to get the dog I don't want to get the dog because like it hurts when they leave it hurts and it might not hurt the way that you hurt but to me it's incom- like I don't want to do that. And and maybe it's because you know it's a protector. You know you gotta protect, and you can't fucking fix that. Like whatever, N- whatever it is, I don't want another fucking. Dog. What's Jude like with the, say a sick animal, or one that gets put down? Like is she emotionally is she, distraught? I'm the one that's fucking sobbing. I say that because my mom has like dealt with so many animals in her life that she kind of, like obviously she she'll get sad, yeah, but like yeah. she's adopted animals and. So she kind of has like a a harder shell when it comes to that stuff. Like she's just, I guess, seen so much. Yeah. That that that's why I was just asking what. No, what Jude's, she she Jude's like no. It, obvi- it obviously affected. Like when we got the news, like she was, you know, she broke down crying and shit. Um, Dude, Alexis is horrible with it. Like, yeah. Really bad. Like what she uh, a couple like <laughs> almost a year ago, I think we uh she had to put down her chinchilla. She's had her chinchilla. Oh no. Had a chinchilla for like ten years. It was tough. I mean, dude, we wait. When was that? Like, a, like a year ago. Uh, it was tough. Like she, she was distraught. It's weird. It was, it was weird walking around after Milo passed. And just like the, it wasn't the same. Yeah. Like it's more quiet. You yeah. don't hear his footsteps. 
You don't see him at his spots. Yeah. It was, it's kind of, it was kind of weird. The worst is like they don't believe that. I mean, she does, right? But like, when, it's like everybody had a an emotional reaction to the news about you know Henry's heart, which is again a very mild case. Now that we found out a week later, I was almost like, I'm like, why don't you fucking tell me until the week happens and then we do the test? Tell me then, you know yeah. what it is instead of me worrying for a fucking week, hiding yeah. that I'm fucking worried because if I'm worried, they're gonna be worried about me and I'm worried that they're worried. I'm just fuck, <laughs> goddamn. <laughs> You Dude, know. that that week when uh uh when Mace went to the hospital because like he bit into yeah, yeah, yeah. my albuterol. Dude, I was freaking out. I mean, that one that one would have been worse too cuz I would have like it would have been on me, mm -hmm. you know? Like it wasn't like natural causes or anything. Like, oh, dude. I I like couldn't eat. That was fucking horrible. But I mean, now I know. I just didn't know that like I didn't know dogs. If you're, if you're, uh, if you have asthma and you have albuterol inhaler, dogs can smell the air in there and they think it's a treat. Mm -hmm. So they'll bite, sweet. they'll bite into the canister, and all of that uh, medicine gets put in their lungs, and it like really affects dogs, Jesus. like really, really bad. Also, um, snow globes, the musical snow globes, what the water the in them is very sweet to them, kills them instantly. Holy shit! I didn't Just know that. fucking keep that shit out there. Silica, right? Like it, they won't kill them, but like it, it, it will affect them like in a bad way. Sometimes, I mean, it depends on the size of the dog, but like fucking careless. They just fucking leave shit. This around. is a grown man podcast. How do you have you ever had a fly problem? Fly? Yeah, like flies, or because you're all your dog shit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no. One, because I do, and it's insane. Do you have, do you have a fly problem right now? In, do they, do they really? get into the house? I mean, when we open the door, like one or two okay. will get in. As soon as you oh, notice oh, them, oh, you gotta hunt them down. Wait, what or what? Though they'll just start breeding in the They're house. Start well, breeding. it's not in the house. Sure, we'll spot some. It's just we open our door to go outside, and it's just <laughs> like. Uh, well, how often we, do you pick up the shit? Can I recommend that you pay forty bucks a week to have some some professional? Wait, my nails long? Why you keep looking at my Some nails Some professional for? shit picker upper? Yeah, that's what we have. Pooper, scoop, pooper, <laughs> pooper, scoop, yeah. pooper scoopers? That's uh, the thing. We should, but even when, like one day I went out there, I picked up, picked up we've, done oh. it a, we've done it a few times, and I did it. And then for like the rest of the evening, I was like, oh, I guess that is the, the issue. I'm going to have to pick up their shit every single day. Then the next morning, uh, they go out, they use the bathroom, they shit. We do whatever we do in the morning. And then comes afternoon, let them out again, they shit. And then, like, I go outside and it's just fly infested again. Like, thousands. You have raid? Like, it's, uh, I don't know. We put down this, like, the pest control. Tiki, tiki torches. We put out this, no. like, pest control no, shit on the grass. It. Nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, that shit didn't really work. Dude, it works. It, if, it, it works. Just have what, your raid? Girl, listen, have your girl hit up my girl and let you and I not worry about that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They, she's got all the but answers. We had um, I think it was like fly outdoor fly catchers, and just thousands would go in. I is think the, it's something about it, like it, all the new construction around. That's who, there's, that's who. There's this. There's this like bucket of liquid that flies get into, and then that look. We have like almost no flies in the background. I'll see them on the shit, but aside, from, they're not like flying around, fucking saying what's bro, up. It's shit. insane. Do you remember that? Fake optic house. Oh my god! Bro. I don't know. No, Did you ever see dirty, that garage? Dirty motherfuckers didn't throw the garbage out. He was like, "We missed it. <laughs> we, missed we, it. we missed it. It was like Dude, nine was, months of missing it. It was bad. I don't know if we ever Little not kids, missed man. it. It was really bad. I don't know if we've uh, we ever had the trash picked up. I would just go downstairs, and all of a sudden, there's those little like cups everywhere of yeah. like of like the fruit flies, the fruit flies shit. So they like they would they would smell the the cups the vinegar. They would go in there. And the whole cup is just full of flies. Well, bro, and then you we opened so the gross. one day we like hired someone to come pick it up. And then when we opened the garage, it was insane how many fucking bugs were in there. Dirty ass kids. Dirty ass fucking kids. Couldn't be me. We really were though. And <laughs> dude, it got to a point where I was talking to Big Timer and he was like, dude, I gotta get out of here. He's like, it got to a point where I'm just grabbing like a 
a bag and holding my breath opening the garage door, yeah. throwing it in there. It was like a challenge to open it, see how fast you can this throw is, your this, trash this in is and the fucking thing, close though. it. This is the thing, though. 1-800-GOT-JUNK. That's what we called. We called got junk a lot. What do you have? It's a garage full of garbage. The old tenants fucking left a mess. Please help. The old, yeah, ten the old yeah. tenants. We're all just like... <laughs> yeah, but at least you, they you, you go away with it. They won't fucking they'll get away from the, the yeah, embarrassment. Yeah. Um, that shit one hundred got junk is like fucking. It's like a great. Did Probably you, overpriced the shit out of they, it. They though. do a hundred percent, but but it's dumb. so does DoorDash. For I mean, you DoorDash can literally go to the store insane. and get and get your shit. You can literally go to the store, but you pay that extra so you don't have to. When my friends ask me to move, <laughs> I hire movers. Yeah. I'll go in there with with my with my oh, mover. Yeah. See, that's what I miss about like small town hometown. <laughs> like if you move. If, I go to Hagerstown. Someone's moving. Need help? Sure. They'll sure. make like Who's in this truck? fucking shit. It's just five movers. You, you know, get move. DoorDash. Oh, yeah. Fucking. It's just I miss the small town life. The Hagerstown. No, like when you I was don't. driving around, no, like. And I think it's just going back to Hagerstown. I feel superior than all of them. Oh my god! Oh my like, duh. Duh. <laughs> Obviously, <laughs> duh. I'm, I'm just kidding. By the way. <laughs> <laughs> Mostly. Did y'all see that Osmond Gold clip or about how Jesus he fucking Christ? <laughs> what is wrong with these fucks, dude? Listen, I'll I'll do respect for his work. I'll do respect for what he's accomplished. I have no issues. But when I saw that shit, I was like, Yo, I know that you got money. Okay, it costs nothing for you to hire someone to handle that shit for you once a week. He's got like money, money. You could hire he's someone. Good. Does he have money, money? I'm assuming. Yeah. See, exactly. I mean, he's well, got to like, be like, like multi millionaire. multi-millionaire. Yeah, he's got like 15K viewers at all times. Okay. Like, of course. For a long time, too, right? Multi millions of dollars. Cool. For sure. Uh, listen, that's pay just... someone to pay someone. <laughs> listen, hey. Do, pay someone to do everything. Hey, listen, there are, th th these are conditions that we don't know what he's going through. You know, maybe he's got separation anxiety, so he wants to keep oh, his he's, cups. He's for sure got some sort of anxiety. Some, I mean, I'm I a dirty know. bastard too, but I am, dude. that I, shit was insane, especially with be, that money. I might be a messy, messy bastard in my office, but outside, outside of that, outside of my wing of the house, none of my shit's in the way except for one little area on the counter, and it's either going somewhere or coming in somewhere. Bro, I remember. But aside from that, I am if you look on my side of the bathroom on my sink everything's arranged it's clean you look on jute's side some drawers have like like fucking handles fucking squeaking shit i'm like baby all you gotta do is tighten the back that's it my if you would have saw my house or my apartment in 2020 it was a dumpster were you how how Nervous. Like it was my dad. I was I was so scared of like a maintenance guy needing to come in oh, and fucking dude. get lost in the trash and shit. Just come in and like this this would be my gaming setup. This is my desk, and then right here is dump is a dumpster <laughs> of fucking DoorDash, whatever type of food, Chipotle pizza boxes, garbage gar bags of garbage. It was insane. Like I didn't even like just didn't even move just. And then just, just it was so bad. I'm, I'm sure it's that insane what my like where my mind was then. I just didn't like. It, it's what you want to know. I don't even think know, didn't care is no, the word. That's it not was, even no. You just oh, I don't even know. Like in my brain, like what were you gonna say? I had Sorry. flies flying around my head. Get like I'd be playing. I'd be here. playing. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> then I had a wasp. Like it was a war. I had, tr I had trash dumpsters. I'm cracked out playing Halo 3 screaming. Up top is flies versus wasps in my fucking, in my like, you know those like circular light bulbs that yeah, like you yeah, can kind of, yeah, yeah. fly versus like, like 20 flies versus one wasp. He's killing them, shoving his stinger. <laughs> Just fucking flies. Like it was li literally, I saw <laughs> wars going on. Like I saw him killing them. If you've ever been feeling a little achy or tense from your recent ranked grind, VeryHeal.com is committed to helping you access the medical cannabis you need with ease. The VeryHeal platform is super simple to use. Just sign up, talk to a doctor, get approved, and that is pretty much it. Before you queue into your next match, the MMJ card will be 
on its way, unlocking exclusive access to limitless resources and serious savings, all from the comfort of your own home. Ready to get started? Visit verheel.com slash optic. That's V-E-R-I-H-E-A-L dot com slash optic for $30 off your first medical cannabis card. Verheel.com makes relief easy. Dude, so you just said all that shit about Osmond Gold, but you were doing the same thing. Yeah, but mine only lasted like nine months. It wasn't He's that bad. He's been though? living like that for years, and I was broke. Did he? <laughs> yeah, that's a thing. Uh, yeah. Well, like, if I had money to just, you know, Paige, here's 20 grand. I need you to take care of my house for the year, hire someone, and then it could get done. If you're Osmond Gold, if you're that's Osmond what Gold. you should do. Or buy a new fucking house. <laughs> Or just get a studio. But I, I mean, I do appreciate people like that that do. Just, no, that I don't. They, Real? they are. You can tell. <laughs> you don't. No, I don't. <laughs> but not. I don't. Not live the way he lives. But the success and the money he's had, he's not doing anything materialistic with it. Which I think you should like treat yourself. You earn this, but you can just tell he genuinely doesn't care about that. And he, all he, I don't really even know what his craft is besides like talking shit. I think it's Warcraft is it world of Warcraft. I'm almost positive. I think so. I think so yeah. Well, I think he plays that, but doesn't he get into like politics and like, I feel like I've oh, I don't know. seen him speaking about like, just about like politics. high last time topics. Last time I heard of, uh, uh, but he just, he, he loves the, he loves the, his work. Yeah. And so that's I all appreciate he loves. that. And that's all he gives a fuck about. Well, I don't know if that's all he loves. Listen, I don't, I, I yeah, don't, I don't like talking about other we're creators. Just talking. Especially we're, not, we're, just talking, we're not talking shit, but it, he, ju- I mean, I think it's crazy that he Dirty was just like, he though. was just like, hey guys, I'm changing this. This is what it looks like. Okay, cool. Click, oh, uploaded it. Okay, okay. I, that's what I, it is. I didn't see any context. I just saw that and I was like, Ugh. oh. yeah, he said, uh, he said like, it's, t- it's time for a change. Click. Wait, click when did he do that? Uh, bring it up. Did you see bring the it uh, bring it up, meathead? Meathead, fuck. What? There's a video. Wait, do you know how to spell Asmund Gold? There's a video of some white, big white, or some white dude and some like Asian girl visiting him, and I think they do a podcast or something. But they visit him, and that's like the whole thing of visiting him is like they're checking out his checking out. Maybe type in like checking out Osmond Gold's house or something like that. I think it was titled something like that. But they kind of walk around with them and, and they, they were like, what the they're fuck like, holy this? shit, this like the sink. And then there's a pan that's just pitch black. They were like, how long has this been? Uh, this been soaking. He was like, uh, since like a day. And they were like, that is impossible. <laughs> this has to what have is been. This? Oh this my is not God. We spent a day at Osmond Gold's okay, house. Time out. Wait, I haven't seen this. Well, how many minutes? All right, I'm yeah, going yeah, yeah, to do a watch it. party on this. Oh, my God. Listen, I, I, I understand. And look, this is, this is indicative. And I'm not calling this guy a genius. I don't know him. I don't know his first name. How about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay? But, like, genius people who are, like, really good at crafts, World of Warcraft specifically. No, kidding. If, they, if they have their own craft, like they don't worry about this thing because it, it's it's insignificant to them. No, but dude, he's probably happier than me too. Yes, that's probably. the thing. Because they don't give a fuck. God, dude. Oh, that's oh my crazy. god. I wouldn't have. I would not have. Listen, I've, uh, I've kind of been here. I have never in my life it's have funny been here. Like, there's a lot of par- there's a lot of like things like that I'm super self-conscious of that I've eventually been able to break out of and like talk about like I've never quit oh like yeah yeah damn my ass sweats a lot like let's talk about it like shit like that dude if I was living like this I would never want anyone to know yeah so like props to him for letting someone come in and vlog but, it. but look and the whole time he's reacting to it like kind of like mm. he's like oh yeah well yeah well they're like where do you go when you need a fork he was like over here and it's just like a new box from Target of plastic forks. <laughs> Holy yeah, shit. I, yeah, all right, me hit, me What's hit. That? Don't ruin it Nut for rags? me. rags? Don't ruin this I got it, yeah, I got to watch this later. Okay. It's like, I, and again, like. But the, I'm, I'm excited to see his after, because he, he took the before they picture. Went into his ro- they after. went into his room, he has a set up, and then beside it's like a couch covered in fucking God knows what. Um, But I think they asked him about the couch, and he was like, yeah, I've uh, just found it i think on like this uh, side of the road for free so like you know gotta take that 
I'm like, no, you don't. <laughs> you don't have to do you, that. You I specific. Mean, you you, you especially. <laughs> yeah. You do not need you that. Do not need if that. anything, Asmongol, do you like taking from the poor? Because you can afford a couch. That that could have been someone who. <laughs> could have been someone. Someone could have came up on couch. that. That would have been a come up for fucking someone. And here you are. Just <laughs> yeah, <fucking. laughs> actually. You know, that was pretty fucked up. You took that guy. <laughs> you know what? We hate you, Doc. Uh, <laughs> Drama with creators. Bradley Martin slapping Base Clan's newest Bro, member. No, it looked like the newest. Ronaldo got picked up like fucking. Oh yeah, yeah. Ronaldo like two years ago. Oh really? Yeah, Ronaldo's oh, been shit. in phase. Yeah. So he used to be. It, it, listen. So who's the Bradley guy? I don't you know, know Martin? Bradley Martin. Come on, man, you know Bradley. Fitness, I, fitness creator. I feel like I've seen him in like memes and stuff. I don't yeah. watch like fitness stuff. Dude, though. me either. And like I, I, he's that big he's that like I know him without me knowing anything about him. Okay. I mean, I, I mean, he. I, I thought I recognized him, but. but he's like an OG. Like, like I can tell he goes to the gym since the beginning. You know, you can tell that he goes to the gym. Yeah, you can tell. Yeah, but yeah, he does like um just gym shit. It's more like a lifestyle. Like he doesn't show like his fucking workouts and shit, dude. Like it's more like picture. gym lifestyle. He look owns a this, gym now. Look at that picture. Like before we even start the video. I will Those say Those two are funny Yeah they are funny But, but like they're and, no, you just, I would have loved to hang out with them Why if, didn't you go to the Oh you weren't in, in here So my bad I weren't It wasn't in but <laughs> I Were they there? Lacey, yeah both of them oh, oh, yeah, yeah, That's yeah, funny Yeah, yeah they, they the, these two seem funny But Let's play the clip I don't want to see this Cheap ass setup. Bow. <laughs> Fucking bitch. <laughs> now I don't know if, if I'm gonna get I'm not that, something listen, bad for this, but <laughs> like this is this is just what a harmless. He got slapped, but it was like a harmless like correction. You know the you, like, and they they tried to say after they try he tried to say afterwards like he didn't know he was balding and was insecure. But, I'm like, bro, Insecure. everyone that knows Bradley Martin, I'm spitting everywhere. Everyone that knows Bradley Martin knows he's like, as a receding hairline, he's balding. And like, that's why he wears a hat. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Yeah, so, why, but, okay. Like these type of, it's just like, this is, this is, this what, is just okay, what listen, I like. Listen. This is, I like I to need, see that. We need more. If, if we need more I'll tell that. you, this is, this is my, this is my thing. Okay. Right. If I didn't know. Ronaldo and I don't know him. I've met him. But if it was somebody that I didn't know, I would have. And been they don't. They don't. Awesome. They don't really know each other, and they've never met before. I don't think. It was just like. Yeah. But it was like Th he level... knows on. They're on camera. Like they. They fucking know. It's like. It's and like even a... if they don't know. I think there's. They're I, still I just there's like. A, uh, there's an aspect of IRL streaming that I really enjoy, and I think it's. I think it's pushing things forward. Yeah. And then there's an aspect where I'm like, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy shit. No, I, I, I miss when we were just playing. Bro, that game. has always been one of the things that irks me, gives me anxiety. Uh, with, with, like the public pranks, like when people go around pranking people. Yeah. Oh, like yeah. Like that always like, it, it, it puts me like on, on such an angry mood. Yeah, because I was, I'm I was like, never I'm a like, fan how, of like, uh, Unless it, it's like casual, unless it's like funny or wholesome pranks, like shit where you're like, when you're walking around saying, oh, yeah, and somebody's fucking oh, ear. Oh, yeah. Like, that, like, come on. In our I mean, younger, some in, in our way younger worse years, shit than that. In our younger years, I had a friend that the first day that I met him, we went to go get spray paint, and he was, like, he was walking around farting, like, next to people, like, Pfft. And I'd be like, I'm like, why are you doing that? Like, oh, well, don't bother people. Why are you doing that? Yeah. It, it like, it gave me like this. Yeah. Like, oh, I was yeah, never like, a prank you, fan. Why are you just like. Like when Crim6 fucking shot me and Formal. With paper. We, we were like shit sharing the twin size bed. And he just comes in. Uh, and just like shoots a couple times. Like, thankfully, we had like blankets and co comforters on top of yeah. us. So yeah, it didn't hurt us. Like it still fucking hurt, but we're like dead asleep. <laughs> it's just someone else's video in for him. Who was it? Who was it? I don't know. It was not me. Probably Flame Sword. I was about to say, I had him Mike. <laughs> Mike's <laughs> in their Mike. video for him. Crew, did they just do it? And I'm just like, what the fuck? And then they leave. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> 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 like, that was so good. 
<laughs> I'm gonna have to get you back for that. And in my head, it's just like, dude, what? Like, what are you doing? I think, I think uh, like this shit fucking hurts you, <laughs> dumbass. Look at it. This is gonna be a good one. How well thought out? Does it just shoot people? Is this Oh no. I think he just shoots me. Of course you don't pick formal. Fucking carried your bitch ass. <laughs> <laughs> How close are you gonna get, <clears throat> dumb fuck? Well, Alright, relax. Oh my god, wait, he is getting he was mad high, close. High, I don't want to see this shit. And how am I not this. awake at this point? Yeah. I probably it. went to sleep two hours ago. <laughs> fucking drunk as fuck, probably. <laughs> no, anyway, like uh Frank's I, like that, but I I don't have an opinion on it. Uh I I would feel the same way that Bradley did if somebody just came, so especially somebody that I don't know, came and ripped anything from me. Yeah. Right. So I, I understand that that I understand that slap that he gave him. You know, I I understand where that came from, and I also understand the surprise that Ronaldo felt when it happened, where it's like, oh shit, like I this I, I didn't know I took it too far. Yeah. He. It, I feel like because you could see in his face, yeah. he was like. Uh, Oh, 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 he's shit. like, actually, like, oh, shit. Like, oh, if it was shit. actually a bad thing, like, I apologize yeah, yeah, yeah. immediately. And I, the, the, I saw a clip of it of when he called, when he, like, canceled the stream. Yeah. And he, you could tell he felt bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, that, that, like, IRL, like, if, if, if that guy was speed, they would have gone way, way more than that. If he was speed or if he was sketch, they would have gone, or jinxy. He, but if they, Bradley slapped them? No, no. If, if, if Bradley wasn't there and that was sketch instead or jinxy, uh, yeah. like, him and Ronaldo would have been able to fucking do that and yell and scream until chase him around the exactly. Fucking, yeah, like yeah, they yeah. would have gone crazy, but like that's just a fitness influencer, which is basically just like a gym dude. It's so different. Uh, yeah, I mean, like he he's not podcast and shit, right? Like, yeah. But I'm saying he's not like a IRL streamer like those guys. No, yeah. no, no, no. I actually like, like that Lacey guy. I, I like event, both of them. I, I think know, they're I, fucking I, I do, hilarious. I do too. I don't. I don't dislike them, but it's just a different level of living it's a it's a whole different lifestyle their content i mean for one they're fucking funny i i I don't think i would be able to do what they do like they're consistently and they're at that age so where like they could literally do whatever Mm -hmm. and it's gonna be like "Eh, whatever you're at that age yeah (laughs) but like these kick streams have turned into like like we gotta we gotta get a clip yeah. So yes. it's like, let's do, we got to do some, like, I know him taking off Bradley's hat. It's like, this is going to like in their head, they're thinking like, this is going to be a clip. Yeah. I don't think he was thinking they're going to, but so like, give me my fucking hat back. And he's like this and he take it. He was maybe wanting like an argument or like something. Yeah. And Bradley's just like, like, I'm not fucking arguing with you. Like that was disrespectful. <laughs> give me my fucking hat. <laughs> my, yeah. And you're just like, so there's just like, and I'm just like, <laughs> I appreciate, I just appreciate that. And, and Renato even said, like, I could probably sue him, but, like, obviously I ain't going to fucking do that shit. The next day or something, he, like, came back with, like, a fully bandaged face. <laughs> like, <laughs> That's funny. And calling his friend a fucking loser because he didn't, he, just, he was he like, you just watched your best friend get, it, get the shit smacked out of him. You didn't do nothing. <laughs> so it's like, they still make it funny. And to be honest, what Bradley did, even though he slapped him and, like, a lot of people will probably be, like, like you're so much bigger than them. No, Why no, would no, you fuck feel- that? Fuck that. Fuck but like, that. N- no, yeah, like I'm, I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why because if you're smaller than someone, you don't do then that. Don't do that. Yeah, that was not retaliation. That was like a life lesson. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. That's, yes, that's exactly. Bradley, Bradley like, let him slap, slap him, him back, yeah. slap him back, oh, and like oh, okay. so. Oh, it's yeah, just, look at the size of him. He's looking at the size of him. He's just slap me. Yeah, slap me. Slap me. As hard as you can. Make sure it's hard. Try really, really hard. Yeah. So I don't know. I I have, but there's just the whole wave of like kick streamers and like drama has to happen for their like like it's like a race to who can yeah get more it's drama like a, and but when it's disrespectful i just feel like it needs to be checked and i feel like it's not checked because it's always just like on live stream and people think it's like we're just it's just a prank we're just fucking around bro chill but it's like you're be, you're on you're purposely being disrespectful for the camera and like i just feel i feel like more just more checking more slapping more like punching needs to happen not in the kick world but i just say like that as a fucking whole the amount of videos i see online these days of people just being so disrespectful little kid like little kids now like i remember when i was younger like if a mother when i was 16 
and the motherfucker is like 24. It's like, I ain't really fucking with them. Yeah. But like these 16 year olds, they see what the successful 16 year olds do. And it's to be disrespectful as fuck to their older yeah. peers. But they just don't face any consequences because everything's on camera. And these people don't want to like get charged or some shit. Yeah. Like they just don't really see consequences besides getting money for the bullshit they do. And I'm not specifically saying that about uh, Renato and what's the Casey case? Uh, what's Lacey, the Lacey. Lacey. I'm not specifically saying about them. Like I, all I've seen is this one clip. I've seen many clips of them and I think they're fucking funny. I think they're a, a hilarious duo. I would actually. I mean, I was going to say I would actually like to meet them, but I mean, like I'll meet them one day, I'm sure. Yeah. Um, them being in phase. But like, no, nah, they seem they seem like pretty cool kids. They were they're, super they're cool. Fucking, at the event, if, I, yeah. if I was if I was their age, I'd probably be I don't know. I, I think they're funny. I, I'd probably hang out with them and shit. But um, so I'm not like specifically trying to shit on them. It's just this way. The wave of the Jack Doherty's and this heel mic and it, you just have to. It's like in kick. You have to be involved in drama. Um, and they just don't face consequences. Do you see that vi vitality? Vital vitality? Pedo searcher. Yeah. He had what? So he, he had like another resurgence. I've seen him come back like eight times yeah. in the internet. He has the craziest. He'll disappear like, for like four years and then you'll be like, that's him streaking at the fucking <laughs> the World Super Cup. Bowl. Yeah, yeah. He, uh, he, got a, he got a kick deal and he basically teamed up with like somebody to uh uh to find like he was like hunting for child predators on his own hunting pedos on his own and he caught one that ended up being a producer a producer for hollywood like, disney like disney or, yeah. producer and then his, and then his uh no questions steak asked. steak uh or his kick deal got canceled after that really he's, st he's still doing it that's what i i I saw. I saw. I know, so, I know he's still doing wrong, it. Wrong, but that's what I've. Heard, that's what I heard. Yeah, he's like it's insane what it is. Like these dudes are chasing, or I don't know what they I, call it. Like kick a kick. Stream. I don't know how they're finding pedos, but then apparently some of them people are saying like this dude's an actor and they've done research and like uh, he's hot. He's see, when he can't find can't someone, he'll nothing, fake it. No but then man. like he'll find them, humiliate them, and then just like let them go. Yeah, he's, and I'm like, well, and what's the? Like, I think he's been caught faking his shit for like. I a think decade, some you know? of it has to be real because some of the I'm like, yep, that no, yeah, definitely some of it's is one. real. But I think it was it him or was it Jesse? Somebody came out and was like, yeah, they hired me off a of Craigslist. Like they literally needed someone to prank. What kind they, of freak would fucking <laughs> do that though? <laughs> what? Like have your image as like. Yeah, I'm the pedophile. They caught me. Oh, <laughs> Pay me true. $50 an hour. That's so true. he probably yeah. got like 200 bucks to just yeah. be fucking no. humiliated. Yeah. And, and have... not only that, but like in, in big channels to where people from your area more than likely might watch yeah. that. I see it. Bro. Yeah. But, no, it's, it's, uh, it's, like, it's, is that Pastor Dave? No, no that's real. That's, 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 <laughs> yes, it is. Yeah. I knew it. I fucking knew it. That's how fucking Yeah, we're going to have to. Fuck you, Pastor Dave. So fucked. We're going to have to find some kids like that around Dallas. What? No, what? Bring okay, them to Optic? No, or wait. No, what? wait. Hold on. I meant like. Wait. <laughs> wait. No, no, no. <laughs> what? I meant. Slow it down. I meant content creators. Got you. Who do ridiculous things. Okay. Ah. Not necessarily the Vitaly thing. I, I was more so going back to like the Renato and. I was just thinking ridiculous. I get you. Yeah, okay. <sighs> These Would that ever, I feel like you wouldn't be down for that. Because it's not. There's an aspect of where, where content has gone that I think we would do, we would go for. I don't think that's one of them. I think. Because I think like is the Mr. Like, Beast I, shit is like more of where. My thing is, is like the last thing that I want. And I know that this is the game and I know that everybody, this is the fucking game and it is how you got to fucking play it in order to fucking compete. And I also know that I'm talking from a very uh, unique place because of what we have done over the last decade and we have history and other people need to hire creators to bolster up like their teams. I don't 
like that. <laughs> Everybody that we have ever had in Optic competed for Optic at one point. The only creators that we have picked up happened after the 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 sale to infinite yeah. that's when all the, everybody started to just pick up fucking random people all over the place i rather pick up people that are friends that are down with optic to be down with optic because of optic instead of the fucking paycheck because at some point or another then optic becomes a fucking sponsor and we are not a fucking sponsor we'll sponsor a fighter in ufc sure but you know what i mean yeah yeah and anybody that disagrees with that tough shit i mean yeah. that shit that's, they, the, that's the game, right? That's, that's, the, that's, that's the, the fucking proven, game. That's been proven to not work, though. No, it's, you know, know how many fucking... I mean, it seems yeah. like every six months there's a huge creator that's like... Pick up an I just want to... Yeah, I just want to thank, thank, thank my time for... X org was such was so great to me. And now, you know, looking for more... Looking for another team. Where? Where? If that fucking creator was down for like that down org, for that. they would have made it work at a... Be like, okay pay me for any time that you use me on camera but yeah, please yeah, let yeah. me still rep the brand so yeah. that if the opportunity ever does come about then that's what i'll fucking do yeah it's so predictable different. no it's, this is what's bad is that it's, it was predictable it was fucking talked about and they still fucking went out and did it anyway um can we get off the business side of this shit and... we, you, we can talk about this i live by a lake <laughs> and every time i drive pa past this lake i imagine getting a boat but I don't know if you're the man I can come to to ask, because you weren't really much of a boat man. I saw that nice ass boat. Oh me, yeah, not you. me. Because I saw I that I'm nice boat. ass boat sitting in the garage mahal for some time. Obviously, I'm not buying a boat like that. That's too expensive out of my league. I, I, need, my I just need like a. Do you still have it? Of course. Well, I live right beside the lake. I I always which see lake? which lake. Oh, you can lake. say it. Like I can say it. Yeah. Fuck it. Uh, Lake Ray Hubbard. Oh my God! Ray like Hubbard that, has like? good bass. Yeah. You want to go fishing? Kinda. Yeah. When? See, this is what Any, it is. I have free time now. Nate's, I'm taking a break from streaming. So if you want to go in the next week, I mean, well, I'm fucking. Just, I got the yeah, bachelor got party this, tomorrow. I'll come back Thursday because Seth can only step away from the computer for fucking one day, even for something as special Dude. as his bachelor party. Wait, where y'all going? Yeah. Uh, Mexico. I'm like, I can't wait to go to bed at nine and everybody be like, come on, stay up. I'm 40 fucking four. You if don't I don't, if you I don't, don't get, have to come to my bachelor party if, if you don't want to. No, we're, I'm, I'm not going to the, where, where is it? Uh, I think we're going to, I think I'm going to have my bachelor party in Vegas. I'll tell you what, if all I have to do is show up yeah, you just and, show and, up. and maybe pay for dinner, I'm there. But if you tell me that I got to book hotel for someone and keep track of shit and nah, not nah, nah. uh, i think the thing with vegas is like because we might i might have my bachelor party in vegas and we might get married in vegas it's going to be a thing where like hey we're going to be here and the flights to vegas are not that expensive you can book yeah, yeah. anywhere you yeah, want yeah, in yeah, vegas yeah. it's like 30 bucks a night so you still have to All buy right. your ticket to europe yeah dude you better dude. get on that shit now you know how much dude. it was for me living jude and you dude. can start from here uh it would have been 30 grand for me live in Jude. Oh my God. Yeah, but you're going like first class and shit. No, the fuck no, we're he's not. not. I looked at tickets and it was like a you month. You should have bought, bought them right there. A, a and month then. and a half ago, we were looking at tickets, but like we we're like, do we want to go early? Do we want to stay after? Then see, we just were procrastinating. See, then a week goes see, by, then two weeks and a see. month. And, and now looked? it's gone from like fifteen hundred to three thousand yeah. dollars. Yeah. And then so now Michelle's like, I don't because she wants to pay like her stuff and like she has money to pay for her stuff she just but i was like i'll help you out I'll, I'll, she ain't gonna she was she wasn't paying for mine like, i was like got, i'll you help me, you baby. out i'll pay for after ticket if we want to stay <laughs> after i'll pay for the hotel <laughs> after and i'm <laughs> it's fucking nick at the movies holding her while she pays for she pays for the, he's holding her from behind she actually did that at target yesterday <laughs> she's at the she's at the american airlines checkout line and he's holding her she did that at target <laughs> or we did that at target yeah. you were just holding her but she <laughs> uses her credit card she gets five percent back and, and then yeah, she yeah. deducts it and yeah, just yeah, yeah. For, uh, yeah. um the flights what was that hotel was fucking it's crazy three thousand dollars now so now she's like i'm probably not going she was like i really want to go but like this is like not only the flights so we'd be spending yeah. six grand Hotel, but the, the hotel. hotels the after, and then the Lord knows what I'm going to be spending while there. I'm sure, like, she'll want to go. 
don't know, see something, shop somewhere, buy yeah, this, course, buy that. I'm buying alcohol. We're at a bar, buy a drink. Like, it's just going to be an expensive ass it's fucking in- trip. Dude, so Alexis and I booked. So we when we in, could go to Mexico in, for like 1500 Yeah. We get into point A, and then we go to point B, and then that's where Seth's getting married. And then Alexis and myself, Blake and Steph, are going to point C, and then we're flying from there. And on the flight back, there, I, was, I was going through everything, and the flights back were like 2100 <laughs> Yep. And then I was scrolling, and there was one first, and that was for Maine, for Maine economy. And then there was a first class ticket for $2,400, but it was a 28 hour round trip. And I was like, Alexis, let's get this. Like, and so we got that one. It's got two layovers. We stop in Dub. <clears throat> we stop s- oh, somewhere. Dang. And we, in Dublin? Yeah, yeah, we stop you in Dublin. Because Dublin. We stop in Dublin and then we stop in, uh, and then we stop in London and then we fly back in. in Wait, when in are you London. in London? The... Something and something? Yeah. All right. Because well, that's what we're doing. It would have been more expensive if we went straight. Yeah. So we're going to London, stopping in London for two days. Okay. Going to point wedding. Yeah. Dude, like she was trying to figure all this out. Dude. Dude, uh, it's hard. Try to make it like. My, call my girl and let them handle it. So, folks. Thank God. Thank God. We're, that- we're recording a podcast. Don't come over here. I just said, said what's why up. Why'd you say what's up? I, I, just, I just said what's up. <laughs> That's so <laughs> fucked that, up. Oh, said what's a, up. Oh. I will, I will, I will. <laughs> those, those Mike Omens, everybody. Co-host, superstar of idiots. Of idiots. Um, superstar. But yeah, you gotta book that shit. Yeah. I mean, at this I point, I might be going by myself. Yeah, was the, bro, this going. is the thing. Like, I was like, I kind of want to not go, but I was like, I kind of like need to go. Like this is be, the, th- dude, yeah. obviously with the dogs being in the, in, in like where they're at, like Jude's like, fuck man, like Henry's heart, you know, oh, whatever, yeah, yeah. mild case, but everything, like she was gone for seven days when we went to Japan and I can only imagine what that did to the dogs who are so dependent on her yeah. and i'm not talking shit about the dogs because i am so <laughs> dependent on her right so uh so i don't know i it's uh it's it's cool but it's gonna be a beautiful wedding man it's gonna be a it's gonna be a good time something that we yeah, yeah. definitely want to it's gonna be great want to obviously enjoy while we're there for sure yeah is there a cheap shit boat that i should get no I need to get an expensive one. No, no, no. You shouldn't get a boat, period. I bought a boat. What about just a, renting a boat? I, bu- I, bought I think a boat. I can rent the boat there. Yeah, yeah, you can. Sure, do that. But they're going to be like 200 bucks to rent. I, I, how about this? Okay, because this, this is the deal. You, don't, you will not use it. Okay, I bought a boat and I'm a bass fisherman diehard. I got a fucking bass tattoo on me. But I also I live five it. minutes from it. Yeah, I live Go out 15 of- minutes from uh, from Lake Louisville, which is like one of the largest ones around here, and I still don't go. I bought it in 2019 for my birthday. It's got 20 hours of runtime. Half of those were when Rob Turkle borrowed it for a fucking week. So I've, I've only used my boat 10 hours. You tell me a day, and you say, let's go somewhere where we can camp out and go fishing the next morning. That's even better because we can hit the lake at 6 a.m., even 5.30 maybe. Let's bring the squad back. Me, you, fathead Pam, Hitch. Hitch, Hitch will be a good... Hitch ain't got to be down. No, nah, he's not down. I'm Bo down. said he was down, so we're not about to test Bo's that theory. Bo can't handle the heat. Yeah, well, we're about to fucking test that theory. But I'm yeah, down. literally this week, yeah, now like watching the NBA Finals game two by myself in the bachelor party, it's not that bad, actually. Yes. Yeah, How about this? Shouts out, Let me ask... Let me ask... Let me ask... Shouts out, Let me ask both of you something. What? If I buy you plane tickets today, will you guys go on this bachelor party? Oh, I don't know. I don't think he wants me there. So I'm just. <laughs> okay. All right. That's a good one. What about you? You don't think he wants you there either? Oh, Honestly, I kind of want to go. Yeah, exactly. See? Yeah, I'm I, not going. Uh, you're not going? I kind of no, want to go. I just go. had a week and a half where I didn't days. stream. I kind of want to go, years. but I would. I don't know. I could talk to Mich- Michelle, but I, I'd also feel like, like I wasn't invited. So it's not like I, I'm not trying to like, dude. You know why the reason why he was that? I'm like, why don't you invite more people? He's like, dude, they're already spending all this money to go to fucking wherever the fuck it is where we're going. I'm not gonna. Yeah, make well, I'm not. I, 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 I know, I know two Seth. Of the, two has, of the groomsmen. Seth are not has going. his crew. 
They're not going no, to the two of the groomsmen, his friends from home aren't going because they can't take off in the middle of the week. Yeah. Aren't going to the wedding or this? To the bachelor party. party. Yeah, anyway, super excited about it. Yeah. Okay, I, you know, last, last time I was here, people... Shit, were, maybe, man. I'm taking a break from streaming. I might come turn up. You can't take a break from something you don't do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I like, streamed so... Like, yo, I'm taking a break from months, working out. Stream six months, break six months. Yeah, it's cool. It's, it's like, a you're good, like a teacher, a dude. Bro, I stream so much, but I, I had to... I'm going to tell you something. You're probably happier than me, too, not working no. out. No. You... <laughs> <laughs> and that's gonna do it for today's Flycast episode. I don't know what, but we'll see you in the next one. Meathead, play that outro music. Peace, guys. Bye bye.